Hello there, this is Tim. I am back for another video. This time I'm going to be just demonstrating iMessage's ability to send files to yourself. So the situation is here, you're on your Mac and you need to send a file to your iOS device, whether it be your iPad or iPhone or say another Mac. So a little known fact is you can actually send an iMessage, you can actually send iMessages to yourself and from the Mac you can actually include files in that. So I'm going to demonstrate here, I've got uh, many different things. I've got an audio file, so let's send that to myself through iMessage, and let's just hit send. So you can see here my iPhone right here, and let's just see what happens. It is now sent. You can see test, test, that was a previous message there. And you'll see in a couple seconds it being sent over to my iPhone, and I should receive a message that shows it as such. So that's that. Let's see how long it actually takes to send that. Because it is uploading that audio and pulling it down to the iPhone. So while that's sending, let's work on the next thing here. We've got a link. So this is a linked compressor. Let's send that. That is now sent. Now, let's send a PDF. What happens when you do that? So as you can see, we just got a compressor uh, link there. That just got sent. Let's open that up. And there we go, from compressor. And in this case, the link did not actually send. It just sent it as plain text. And here we go. We got the audio. And that did send as a relevant thing. So that's sent. And we can hit just hit play here. And there we go. It's playing. So, boom. That's enough of that. So audio is sent. Now let's work on sending that PDF message. So PDF, let's see what happens when I try to send that. PDF, let's send that. And it is now uploading or sending that. Next up, let's just send a picture. So we got a picture there, let's send that. So we're just gonna, I'm just gonna show you the usefulness of being able to send stuff to yourself, Mac to Mac, iPhone, you know, Mac to iPhone, Mac to iPad, whatever the case, you can send stuff to yourself. Besides a PDF, you can send a text file. You can send all sorts of stuff. So let's send the text file. Boom. Okay, so we got TIFF that is sent. Let's open let's open this uh, PDF here. And PDF is now loaded. Now this is just a screen uh, PDF of the Apple page. A cool thing here is you can actually open this file in iBooks. So any file that is supported within apps can actually be, you know, printed or you can even just you know, open that in another app. So I can actually open this in iBooks, Goodreader, Evernote, things like that. So you can use iMessage, iMessage to get files into your apps on your iOS device. The picture, there we go, the picture did load. The picture can also be opened in a number of apps, including Goodreader, Evernote, Camera Plus. So if you click on, say, uh, Goodreader, that will launch that picture right up into Goodreader. And there we go. So you can see the usefulness usefulness of this right away, I hope, being able to send files from your Mac to your iOS device. So let's send this text file, see what becomes of that. And you can just experiment with all these different file types to see what works. Anything that is really supported on iOS will work with this pretty much. Movies even work. Movie files work. And then we will send that as our last test thing there. So there we go. We have now have our uh, our text file, and you can open that or print that just like you can a PDF. So really, really handy stuff here. So let's try to just find something. Let's find this movie. Let's send this movie over. So we're just dragging and dropping. That's all we're doing. Dragging, dropping this movie, and we are sending that movie over through iMessage. iMessage is totally free. It works over your 3G connection, Wi-Fi connection, anything like that really really slick so if you're looking for a solution to send files to yourself this is just one way the notes app the notes app can do this i believe and i'll be demonstrating that in a future video but until now i i hope this is just a handy demonstration for how you can send files to yourself and i hope that this movie file just, uh, makes it way it makes its way over it should be here rather soon but uh, if not, uh, just know that it did come and it will be played in the future because that is uh, something you can send over. So with that, I am Tim Chatton. I run the iWake podcast. It's a daily Apple news show. You can find over at iWakePodcast.com. And I thank you for watching. Please uh, stay tuned for future videos as I go over tips like these. Aloha.